I don't know why. <laughs> I can't get this right. I don't know. My microphone keeps coming out of the wall. Yours is still fine. Yeah. I do get up. I mean, you add 10, ten times, times more. more than you do. Send help. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid directions of Corbin. I'm Rick. Please follow us on Instagram and Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks on Patreon. Follow us on Twitter and subscribe the like button. Can it go into just something that sits on the floor? Just like a that kind of a stand? No. No. Yeah. yeah. Today, this will be a, something fun. Um, <laughs> so you know Rocky. Not Rocky by Rocky Sylvester Stallone. Slightly familiar yeah, with slightly it. Slightly familiar. And his workout scenes in the first Rocky to get prepared. Correct? Yes. Apparently, somebody in an Indian film in 1984. Okay. Uh, named Dharmendra. Basically, I don't know if they were remaking Rocky, but they remade basically his entire the workout the montage. workout montage. Okay. There's there's two I, workout montages. Yeah. I don't think it's an impressive comparison video. <laughs> Is it the one? Have you seen the guy on the video? I don't know if it originated as an Instagram reel or a TikTok or a YouTube, but it's this guy who goes and he takes, his, puts an egg here, and he pops the egg, and he says, yeah, "Built different," and then this like twelve-year-old girl goes. <laughs> uh, so yeah, this. You ever a... drank raw eggs like Rocky does? No, I tried once. It's gross, right? Oh, it's like drinking a giant snot. I can't do it. Yeah, I won't do it. Here we go. This will make you want to watch Rocky, probably. Yeah. I haven't seen Rocky. Don't film it. Changed my life. I haven't seen Rocky in years. It's a great movie. It'll always be a great movie. Whoa. That's the music on speed. Exactly the same. <laughs> what do you eat? Forty nine. Oh, God. Oh, my, you're going to hurt yourself. Those definitely. Those were not real weights. <laughs> what? what? He's doing yoga? <laughs> why, is he get, why is he getting Body bigger? Chopping. It's on speed. Copyright. Physiques are so similar. It's some very similar. deeply surprising. <laughs> Great punches. Oh. Professional fighter punches. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <was> clearly <laughs> holding him underneath. This is both Rocky and Rocky 2 montages, by the way. Oh, What's about to catch you catch a little chicken? What we need is speed. Greasy. Speed! Those are the mean streets of you, Philadelphia. You're gonna, get, you're gonna get all the kids running with you too? <laughs> so is it a is it just a montage they copied or is this a like a rocky remake? I don't know. Because he hasn't really got the physique for a boxer. No. <laughs> yeah, this is Rocky 2. The earlier sequences were from the original Rocky. Where's Rocky Five? <laughs> I think it's just a man running. It's funny. The first in the first Rocky when he's running down that street, 
Nobody knew what he was doing. Yeah. They had no permits. And the guy who throws him an orange? Yeah. Was that? That's legit. That's just some dude throwing him an orange. You've seen these a few times. A few. I pretty much know every frame. And I've done every exercise he does too, because he inspired me. I've done every, I've like, the goal was to replicate everything he does. Especially his Rocky IV workout. Wow, stunts. <laughs> wow. Now he's going to go out and just blaze past him. They're telling him, go, go, and he can't keep up. Next shot is him just going, pushing, get the close up. Oh, well, well. Oh, uh, wow, so fast. They've sped him up. <laughs> <laughs> the magic of movies, everybody. Wow. Wow, what a punch. It's a shot for shot remake. Shot for shot remake. And the same physiques and everything. Oh, it's uncanny. <laughs> I couldn't tell which one was Sly and which one was Darmendra. Hard to tell. So, like, okay, so it's from a nineteen eight. So Rocky, obviously Rocky was nineteen seventy six. Seventy six, and then Rocky two, nineteen seventy nine. Yeah, and so this came out nineteen eighty two. Is it a, is it a direct remake of Rocky, or is it just like they wanted a fight scene in the film, right? Or and they just scene did and a they workout just scene, did a, a Rocky, because they were like people in India haven't seen Rocky. I guess yeah. I don't know. <laughs> that was like. And I love the guy that was literally they holding didn't even him underneath. Hide the guy. I know, they holding him from underneath. He couldn't even hide him. And and kids don't use. <laughs> oh my word! Oh. Don't use dumbbells like that. <laughs> yeah, this, this one was my favorite. Just the <laughs> like you're gonna hurt something. It looked like it was supposed to be a hundred something pounds. He <laughs> <It> was just. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sylvester still doing work getting stronger. Darmenjo is acting and gaining his belly. Yeah, it's true. It seemed he was getting a little bit thicker with each new workout section. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Did um I can't imagine Sylvester Stallone is actually that fast. So it's clearly something that they made everybody else slow down. No, no, no. That was legit speed with him running at that point and the kids it was children running with him and the one that was closest okay. to him was like 11 years old okay. so an 11 year old kid is not going to keep up with a 32 year old man in that shape so no they didn't speed him up at but all granted he doesn't strike me as a fast man no either. he's he's not but his com, physique com, is not one that is uh, no but, fast. Com, but when he's in a full sprint there's a it's i guess a, an 11 year old is going to keep up an 11 year old yeah and it's in it as you can see the kids kind of keeping up with him but then over time he just starts to slow down as he pulls away and yeah i mean obviously there's no trickery in anything that's everything slide did slide did yeah, this guy as well yeah. Domendra as well yeah though though the workout routine i'd <laughs> like to see someone replicate is rocky 4 somebody some call Domendra the uh, Sylvester Stallone of india maybe Actually, a lot of people call uh, Sylvester Stallone the Darmendra of America. That's true. So, oh. <laughs> I need to watch Rocky again because like, it's a great, I, I was great the, movie. Because I had the VHS pack when I was a kid, and like full five films. Yeah, like, and I would watch them all the time. Loved them. Um, but I probably haven't seen it in at minimum fifteen years. It's one at of the minimum. It's it's one of the best movies ever made at every single level. It's got great casting, great acting, great screenplay, great directing. Uh, you believe every sing it it is the film for me that took me from thinking about what I did 
as a performer because I was a performer. When I was on the Partridge family and everything I did, I was a singer and a performer. My dad took me to see Rocky, which I predicted was going to be terrible. Mm. He said, Dad, come on, who's Sylvester Stallone? He says, from the Lords of Flatbush. I said, no one sees that movie. Come on, Dad, let's not go see it. We saw it. I still remember walking out of the theater. I can see the red carpet on the floor as I'm walking up. It's a slight uphill walking up. And I turned around and looked at the screen as the credits were going because I, I was so blown away. I believed those... Adrian is a real person. Paulie, her brother, is a real person. Mickey is a real trainer. Rocky is a real guy. Apollo Creed is the heavyweight champion of the world. It, 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 and it's just from start to finish, it's such a believable movie. And it's a beautiful story because it's, it's Stallone's passion project, and he didn't cave to the requests. People liked the story, but they didn't want him. They yeah. wanted a big name actor and they offered him six figures and he was dead broke, struggling actor living in New York. And he said, no, if, if we make the movie, I've got to do it. And the reason Rocky was made is he auditioned for Erwin Winkler and Robert Chardoff. I think it was Erwin Winkler who did it. He was walking out the door and his gut told him, let him know you have a script and ask him if he'd read it. And he turns around at the door and he says, I wrote a, a movie about a boxer named Rocky. Could I drop the script by? And so to this day, Stallone will say, if I hadn't obeyed my gut in that moment in that audition and just asked if I could send him the screenplay, who knows if anything would have ever happened. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, watch it. It's a great, great, great movie. Oh, I know that. I've seen it many times. Uh, just having it. No, long. yeah. Even in a rewatch, you'll probably appreciate it even more. Especially Rocky V. Uh, we all know. Best Rocky there. Oof. Uh, <laughs> Oof. Uh, let us know what other videos we can react to uh, down below. Just